This is question number five on geometry homework number nine. This is just a review problem solving uh, algebra. So it says solve for y. Um, so I'm going to copy down the problem negative 20y plus 15 equals 2 minus 16y plus 11. I'm going to draw my line through the equal sign so I can keep things on the right uh, sides. And if we look here, we have two um, terms that have y in them. We have this negative 20 and we have this negative 16. So I want to combine those, um, definitely, so I can get them together. And then also over here, I have this 2 and then this 11. Um, so those need to be combined as well. Let's first start by moving the y over to this side. And you could actually move whichever side you wanted to. I'm going to move this one first. So this is minus 16y. I'm going to add 16y on both sides. This will cancel, and negative 20 plus 16 is going to be negative 4, and we carry down that y. I'm going to carry down everything else. 15 equals 2. This symbol went with this 16y, so we're not going to use minus plus 11. We're just going to use plus 11. Um, so now if I look over here, I can combine these two next. 2 plus 11 would give us 13, and I can combine them because they're the same type. They're both integers. If this had a y on the end right here, this 11y, we would not be able to combine it. Um, carry down everything on this side, 15 or 4y, negative 4y plus 15. Um, we almost have y by itself on this side. We have to get rid of this right here to move it over. Um, so this is a plus 15. I'm going to subtract 15 on both sides. This cancels and I'm left with negative 4y equals 13 minus 15 would be negative 2. And then the, our final step is just we need to get the y by itself. So this is multiplying by negative 4. I'm going to divide by negative 4 on both sides. This cancels, and I'm left with y equals negative 2 divided by negative 4. Well, let's think about the sign first. A negative divided by a negative would be a positive. And then 2 divided by 4, we can't do that into an even number, but we can simplify. They both can be divided by 2, so 2 divided by 2 would be 1, and 4 divided by 2 would be 2. And again, I'm not putting the negative sign because a negative divided by a negative is a positive. So our answer is y equals 1 half.